Shoot her! I will give up. Shoot her! Down the gun. I'll let everyone leave. My crew and I will leave. We won't bother you anymore. AJ. She's not a threat. Man, get your pickle chin that way. Now, hi guys, and welcome everybody to The Walking Dead Season 2. Wait, wait. No, hold on. Season 4, Episode 3. I don't know where I got two from. Listen, yo, we are literally, after this episode is done, we are almost near completion for this series. That means y'all can't ask me for this series at all after it's done. Wait, hold on. I lied. There's only two more episodes left? Where's Episode 5? They don't got five episodes? Okay, all right. Here we go, episode three. Let's get into it, baby. Previously on The Walking Dead. Mm. While searching for a place to call home, AJ and I found an old boarding school run by kids deep in the forest. Right. Their leader was a guy named Marlin. And AJ <laughs> pulled the trigger. I like how they just cut to him dead. I told AJ he was justified for killing him. The other kids didn't see it that way. They voted to kick us out. I thought we'd never return. Then, AJ and I were attacked by Abel, one of the raiders Marlin had given the twins to. He was with someone I thought I'd never see again. Lily. We were almost eaten by walkers when suddenly one of them spoke to me. His name was James, an ex-whisperer who didn't believe in killing walkers. He helped me treat AJ, but without real medicine, he wouldn't make it. The kids didn't turn away the sad sight of AJ and let us back inside. After I told them how we could defend the school against the raiders, they were willing to let us stay, at least until the fight. I decided to help Violet in the bell tower. We looked at the stars together. Violet is a great friend. Those are rare. Then the raiders finally came. They busted open our gates, but the kids stayed hidden as planned. Until Ten ran out of cover, hoping for a chance to learn about his missing sisters. The bomb went off, and attempting to save Ten, Mitch threw himself at Lily and got a knife to the throat. With only a second to decide, Nobody liked Mitch anyways. I fired and saved Violet. They got away with three of our friends, and we had no idea where they'd gone. But we knew someone who did. Oh, buddy, right there. So this episode is us getting our leg back. Okay. I'm excited. Bitch, me too. It's kind of gruesome. I won't even lie to you. Who's crying? Oh. Bitch. <laughs> Dumbledore right here. I hate this kid. Why yeah? Why y'all looking at me like I did it? At the start, I was so little. And, and Mitch looked after me. People said he was a dick sometimes, but he was always nice to me. Now he's gone. Stabbed in the eye by some asshole who never even knew his name. Look, I promise you, Willie, the people who did this were going to hit them back. They're gonna regret ever coming near us. If Mitch were here, he wouldn't cry. He'd find a way to get our friends back. And he'd bash Lily's brains out with a rock. There you go, Dumbledore. Hey, AJ's waiting for you in the basement. We got Abel tied up tight. He's alive, but he's out cold. Thanks. We should bury Mitch. It's time. Damn. I'll help you kill Get away from him! What? You're the reason he's dead! Yo, chill out! Really? Well, it's true! We had a plan, and that idiot messed it up! Hey, 
Cut that shit out! Someone's gotta say it! It's what everyone's thinking! Ten! Yo, look I'll take how care of this. Talk to Abel, find out where Lily took Lewis. I don't like how they did my man's ten like that. And Clem, don't be afraid to, you know, hurt him a little. Maybe you'll get more out of him than we did. Say less! Say less. I watched Russian movies growing up. I know what they did. I got it from here. Let me handle it. Aw, oh, Rosie. Interrogate Abel. Oh, I'm about to have a field day with this bull day. Yo. Oh, Put AJ. Your gun back, huh? Uh huh. The one that Louis tried to take. Still want dibs? It's different like this. With well, them all broken. But I still hate him. Oh, he a demon. Ready? Let AJ wake him up? Nah. Drench him. Psh. Start out with a rude awakening. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Hi. Hey, sunshine. Well, it ain't no way to wake an old man up from his afternoon nap. I was having a nice dream, too. About a girl I used to know from before. She also had me tied up, but I wasn't her prisoner if you get my meaning. <laughs> okay, buddy. Okay. Stop the cat. This dude funny. He lying no about offense. getting kitty. But I'd rather go back to my dream, so if you don't mind. Damn. Damn, AJ. <laughs> Yo. Yo. Easy on the broken parts. I don't like your voice. Well, I'm real sorry about that, but it's the only one I got. Yeah. And don't call me Squirt. You're a Squirt. Yeah, let him know. First thing you learn, I can't tell you shit if I pass out from the pain. Don't make this harder than Why was he want to a be, piece okay? too? Yo, hold on. I know where Lily took my people. It doesn't matter. As soon as she gets there, she's going to turn around and come right back for me. <laughs> you better give me the five star treatment. If I'm smiling when she gets here, you might be able to trade me for a little mercy. We underestimated you little shits, but sick Rosie on him is crazy. Won't make the same mistake twice. She'll be back. Trust me. You think Lily would come back for you? Look at the state you're in. You're worthless to her now. I can heal. There is no rescue party, Abel. Only a bunch of pissed off kids who want you dead. So tell us where our friends are. You trade it for mercy. <laughs> Lily will never give him up. Only reason we came here was for more manpower. Losing Jonathan and me, for three sprouts that can barely hold a gun. Even a dummy like me can do the math on that one. We're gonna get him back. You don't know what it's like out there. It's a bloodbath. One community against another. From Richmond to the coast. Back at the Delta, we're at war. Some really Back sick the Delta. fucks who make me look like the Virgin Mary. We need people to fight it. Soldiers who do what we say. Point the guns the That's way called we kidnapping. tell them to. You little turds are supposed to be easy pickings. Turds. That's called kidnapping. Give it whatever name you want. I call it survival. What kind of place is Hold this Delta fight? if they use forced labor to defend it? You think we like doing raids like this? Our home is under threat. It's a good home. Built to last. I'd do a lot to protect it. Maybe you can understand that. And I do a lot to get my friends back. So stop wasting my time. Okay. Front pocket. 
answer to all your questions. Read it. Whatsoever parteth the hoof, and is cloven-footed, and cheweth the cud, among the beasts, that shall ye eat. What the fuck? Is this code? No, it's fucking Leviticus. I was hoping it'd be some timely, moralistic shit about turning the other cheek. Well, come on. That thing ain't gonna light itself. Wanna know where your friends are? The smoke will clear my mind. Yeah, I'm about to smoke you up, boy. Help me remember stuff. Like where Lily went. Lamb smoke? Burn him? Come on, kid. Don't make me wait all day. Now that is heavenly. <coughs> Wait, what? That's a lot of blood. Oh, fuck. This is not good. Wait, don't tell me I just lost him. He's gonna die, isn't he? Isn't that what you wanted? I did, but... You're gonna get your wish. When you pushed me off that balcony, something must have burst inside of me. <laughs> Shit. I never wanted things to end like this. Everything. It all got out of hand. Now look at me. I'm a fucking mess. Will he turn? No! <laughs> I lost him. My, my whole life, everything I ever got, I got with my own two hands and my will. Buddy's speaking Japanese. For my body. Come on, buddy. To turn on me. To take control. I'll tell you where to find Lily. Where? Just promise. You won't let me turn. I'm begging you. If you're honest with me, I'll put you out of your misery. You have my word. Okay, we have a boat. We're docked a few miles west of here at an old fishing pier. Your friends are on the boat. <laughs> you, you got what you wanted. Please, don't let me become one of those things. Please, I don't want to turn. I'm a man of honor. Y'all know that. Not that. I wanna let me keep my face. What? You don't get no answers. You don't need to watch this. I want to. Oh! All right, here we go. Tormata. At least you can't hurt anyone anymore. Yeah. You just tortured a man in front of him? Okay, and what? Tata, you telling me like this, like I care. Like I care, man. Come on. AJ can't be no sweet soft boy. You're the gangster of the year. Stop playing with my mans. Look at him. He need a taper though. I won't lie to you. Somebody fade him up real quick. I hate Dumbledore. Damn, it's really us. Once That's we it. find the boat, we'll look for a way to sneak on board. Yeah, if Ten doesn't fuck it up this time. It wasn't Ten's fault. Yes, it was. 
Mitch died because he- Say one more thing about Tim. I dare you. Guys, look. Yeah, you about to catch a ten. Hey. Oh, boy. I highly doubt this is a trap. This gotta be a trap. You see anything? The beach, um, a boat, and a, a wood street in the water. That's called a pier. Hmm. Pier. Okay. Let's spread out and focus on those areas. Keep your heads low. Spy on the Raiders. I ain't even talking to no Mitch. Find anything over here? They have horses. Let me see. Are those torches? I think so. Could be easy fire. Setting the hay on fire would get their attention. Scare the horses too. We could get on the boat easier that way. If we cut those horses free, we could slow down anyone trying to chase us. You ever seen this boat before? No. Marlin kept us confined to the safe zone. Pier leading up to the boat? It's our only way in and out. Well, let's see what else is down there. There are a few on deck, a couple others on the pier. Could be more inside. Looks like they're well armed too. See Lewis. Abel wasn't lying. This is it. Perfect. W choices. The pier has plenty of cover on it. If we're careful, we can sneak in undetected. I don't see any obvious place to keep prisoners. They're probably below deck. We should have asked Abel. When he said on a boat, I didn't think it'd be this big. I can see an entrance. I saw that too. It looks like there's a door at the other end. There's a small opening at the top of those closed doorways. AJ and I know how to deal with those. All right. There's no good cover leading up to the boat. We're gonna need one hell of a distraction. Walker! Maybe if we could get walkers on the beach somehow. Maybe not as hard as you'd think. Okay. A rabbit's foot. Omar used to carry around a rabbit's foot. You don't think? We'll take it home. We can give it back to him once we've saved him. What the hell carrying around a rabbit foot, bro? Must have fallen off one of the horses when the raiders came through. Okay. I think that's it. I guess we gotta talk to what's it called now? Dumbledore. Anything useful? Looks like building material, furniture, probably stuff from the train station. Sheet metal, wood, and quite a bit of it. We should have that stuff. All right. More torches. Torches? We could use the fire. Oh, yeah. Buddy's slow as hell. They're loading those rafts with supplies. 
I could cut those loose and just ride them down river. Easy. We should get out of here before they spot us. We can talk through the plan once we're somewhere safe. What's the plan? Well, they've got guards posted on the pier and the boat. There's no way we can take them all at once. Our only hope is to distract them while we sneak on board. We should burn their stuff. Mm. That'd work. We could burn the supplies or the hay they keep for the horses. Whatever we don't burn, we should take. Ruby would love to have the horses. But I'd rather steal those supplies. Yeah, we'll steal their supplies and burn the hay as our distraction. If you're going to steal from the rafts, you have to do it carefully. Wouldn't do it any other way. The fire will lure the raiders away from the boat, and we can sneak across the pier. If anyone sees us, they'll shoot! You remember that guy I told you about, James? He sent in walkers to save us from Lily and Abel. Maybe we could convince him to do it again. If we lead a big enough group of them onto the beach, we can blend in without being seen. Yeah, but how would we do that? Perfect. What about after we get everyone home? I mean, the raiders will just come attack us again. What then? Hide, quick! A raider. Has to be. You all stay here. I'll see if they know anything that could help us. Alright, damn, we rolling out like this? Drop it. How many of you are there? How many of who? I'm not fucking around. Answer the question. Eight. There's eight. Clementine, wait. That... That's Minnie. I knew it was one of y'all crackheads. Y'all look like y'all got the same chin. Chin of hell. Captain Chad Chin. Sorry. After the attack, I wasn't sure. I mean... I heard they burned half your school down. Who survived? Ruby? Mitch? Brody? Ten? Ruby and Ten made it. Mitch didn't. And Brody, um... She died. Ten's boots holding up okay? His boots? They're so old, they're more holes than rubber. I duct taped him up the last time I saw him, but that was a while ago. His boots are fine. You're Clementine. The girl who took over after Marlin died. It's weird. I thought everyone would want to lean on their own. Not the new kid. Your leadership is going to get my little brother killed. What? Watch your mouth, because I'll beat the Even bricks off you. to talk Marlin into handing everyone over like he and Lily did, but like they did before. You ruined the whole plan. What the hell he gave you and Sophie away? Yeah, and we all survived it. Marlon would have never made them fight the way you did. He wouldn't have gotten people killed. Okay. Many are wrong. Glenn protected us. He wouldn't have gotten people killed. He murdered Brody. What? Sophie, is she alive? She, she died protecting the Delta. Oh man! A hero? God, you Nerva! Shit! Your your name is Yenerva? Oh, 
Hail. Rockingham! Finish up and head back. I want to be in before dark. Yes, ma'am. Our boat leaves for the Delta in two days. Then it'll be a couple of weeks before we can come back for the rest of you. When we do, don't fight. The only way you're gonna save your people is to let us take them. I'm serious. Don't fight this. It's not too late, Minnie. You could come back to the school with us. No. No, I couldn't. Wait, they want... Nah, don't... Ah. Uh... Are you okay? Nothing's changed. Our plan is to get onto the boat and save our friends. So that's what we're gonna do. You all should head home. Start getting things ready. Get everyone caught up on the plan. Everyone except Ten. I warned you. Enough, both of you. AJ and I will go find James. Good luck. That's a hard one, y'all. Yeah. So, how many walkers do you think James will help us get? Fifteen? A hundred? A thousand? Come on, shut your ass up. I don't... Ow. Gunshot wound. It feels like someone pinched me from inside. Here, let's rest a second. Clem, I, I keep thinking. When Willie said all that stuff about Tin before, I got so mad. He was being mean, and Tin wasn't even there to defend himself. I wanted to hurt him. I know I shouldn't, but I just can't stop thinking about it. I want to just punch his head. Damn. I, I tried breathing, kicking rocks. I know it's hard, AJ, but thoughts like that, they go away. You just have to give it time. Uh, waiting's hard. I'm just thinking too much. Like, I think... I think I'm mad at Tin, too. Running out of cover when Lily attacked the school was really stupid. But he just doesn't know stuff like we do. And then Willie started yelling at him instead of helping him learn. Why don't the other kids know all the stuff we know? When there's a plan, you have to follow it. And when you yell at someone, it just makes them not listen. Well, why don't we teach them? They're smart. Someone just has to show them what to do. Yeah. I want Tim to know how to be safe. We can show them how to be smart, like us. It's weird that people are so different. Huh. <laughs> it is Erickson's boarding school for troubled youth. Troubled youth. Trouble like bad? So they did bad things? Why? <sighs> okay, um, sometimes they do them because bad things happen to them. I knew a doctor once, back when you were just a baby. He called it trauma. You have some too, you know. The thing where people can't walk up behind you? I don't like my trauma. I want to get it off of me. How do I get rid of it? I don't even like the way the word sounds. You never get rid of it? Uh, it doesn't work like that. It's too deep down inside you. It never goes away. That sucks. But you can resist it, just like anger. That's very true. You can't lie to a kid. I still like them. 
I like Tin the most, I think. Even if he does dumb things. Actually, I think he's my first real friend. Oh yeah? I thought I was your first real friend. Well, yeah, but you don't count. You're old. Why? Well, I need that not. Old. Fine. He's my second first real friend. Man, I'm gonna miss this bond. I'm telling you, all this is done. And I know it's coming soon, man. Try it. We'll be trapped. <laughs> See James, just monsters. <clears throat> James, you're hurt. Did the Raiders do this? It looked like they had people from your school. Why are you here? Those people you saw, we're going to save them. But to do that, we need your help moving some walkers. could maybe help, but my mask is still in the camp, inside my bag. I can't pass through a herd without it. Okay, then let's go get it. Please, I just... I just ask that you don't kill them. The walkers. If you distract them, I can sneak over and find my mask. Distract all of them? Please. Right? I'll... I'll try. No promises. Got it. I got it. I got it. Why well, I can't damn move? I can't move. I'm done for. Damn, hold on, y'all. Are you good? I don't know how long I can keep this up. Did you find your mask? I can't find it. The horses must have... There! Oh, shit. We have to run. Hey, over here! No, there are too many of them. The cart. If we push it, the noise will draw them away. Okay. I'm pressing Q. Got it. A lot of momentum. Go oh, ahead, hey, dummies. Dummies. Hey, Jay, are you okay? Yeah, no bites. <laughs> Except for the one right here. <laughs> I know it would have been easier to kill them. <laughs> you don't imagine. Or kind. I appreciate it. Really. <laughs> Hey, ranky danky ass party city map. Mask, sorry. Thank you for helping me get this back. Uh huh. Now, how will Walker save your friends? They're being held captive on a boat not too far from here. We can't sneak on board without cover, not without the raiders gunning us down. You want to use walkers to hide, to sneak on board their ship? That's insane. It's our only chance. Please. I 
pretty please. I have something I need you to see. What? So you can understand what you're asking. James. We still need his help, right? Yeah, we do. Are you sure about that? Just a little further. Talk to James. My people. My former people, they had a practice. They called it collecting. What? Collecting what? Oh, y'all are sick. They used them as a weapon. I do this to protect them. I know it sounds strange, but that's why I brought you here. To see them as I do. As people. As people? Well, not people exactly. But... <sighs> something in between. Part of us is still in there. Deep down. So few of us die anymore. We turn. Bro, can not you dead, help? Not alive. Can you help me? God, I hope that's not true. That sounds like hell. Can you just help to me? To you, maybe. I think it seems peaceful. Do you really think there's people inside of monsters? Somewhere. Yes. Think about it this way. Has someone you cared about turned? Clem's friend, Lee. She let him. But she wishes she didn't. Do you really think there's nothing left of who he was? No, he's gone. Even if his body is still moving, there's nothing left. Just a walker. I'm sorry you feel that way. I lived among walkers for years. Still do, in a way. When they're alone, they're harmless. Innocent. If you want my help, I need you to try and walk with them. Then tell me if you really believe they're just monsters. They are just monsters. Right. They're not people or friends. Clem. She'll be safe, I promise. This isn't smart. It's too dangerous. She just needs to move as they do. I'll be fine, AJ. I'm doing this, okay? I... <sighs> okay, fine. Hell, bro, are you trying? I ain't gonna get like some sort of disease just putting this mask on? The first rule is never go alone. I'm not leaving you. I'll be right back. Check the windows. I will. Remember to breathe. I will. I promise. You're just looking after me. Ah. The mask will disguise your scent. But be gentle. And be quiet. Touch the wind chime. You'll see. He 
He is sick. I'm done for. I'm so done for. Get your... Get your mother. Damn, look how he punched him. Man, get your hot breath away from me. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> Want me to touch that? That easy. It's kind of beautiful in a way. It's very beautiful. Damn, bro. Whoa, hey there, kiddo. It's all right. I'm fine. See? No bites. No bites. So, do you still think they're just monsters? Now that you've seen um, that piece, any different at all? I, I think you might be right about there being something more to them. It was kind of nice in there. Really? Kind of. I never met someone who understood. Yeah, can you help me now? It's... Thank you. I'm glad. Have you ever killed a walker before? I have. Many. Have you ever killed a person? Many. Damn. But that was a long time ago. I've killed someone before too. AJ. You've killed someone? But I was justified. Yup. I see. <sighs> That's enough. What about the walkers? Are you going to help us save our friends? I thought I could, but I can't. So many walkers would die. <laughs> All of the death this would cause. I'm sorry, Clementine, but I can't have more blood on my hands. You saved AJ and me because you said you didn't want us to become soldiers. What makes it okay this time? They're going to make all our friends into killers. More violence, more death. And you could have stopped it. I may be stubborn, but I'm not heartless. Okay. Those raiders are cruel. They force others to be the same. And if your friends are anything like you, I don't doubt they're worth saving. It'll take some time to guide them through the forest to the shore. Others will join the herd as they go. Okay, Tomorrow Spider -Man. night, be ready. I can't undo this. Sir, yes, sir. Mm-hmm. 
You said there might be people inside walkers. Did you mean it? Is he right? That's why he wanted to hear. Honestly, I just told him what he wanted to hear. Walkers are just walkers. So you lied? We needed his help to save our friends. So lies can help sometimes. Come on, AJ. There's a value in lying. Listen, I'm, I'm be honest. There's plenty of times where I lied to save my butt. I do it again. It's a white lie, not a black lie. Two different things. The next day. Oh, yo, hold on, y'all. Hold on, hey. Um, damn. First of all, it's a brand new day. Uh, what the hell is this? Like, that's what I'm saying. That's how y'all know it's a new day, because this wasn't here yesterday. Where we left off. I've never met anyone like James before. I mean, he's tough. Not like you, though. He doesn't kill monsters, but he's not scared of them either. Nah, he a weak. He's weak cool. No, he not. He's sick to the head. Hey, Clem. Willie told me the plan. How'd things go with that guy? James. He agreed to help us. If somebody told me we were gonna sneak onto a boat and a herd of walkers. I'd call them crazy. What are you doing with those? Oh, well, I wanted to throw one last hoot nanny before the big fight. A what? Swear? Huh? What nanny? It sounds like a swear. Yeah, definitely sound. Nah, hold on. Gibberish. <laughs> what the hell is a hoot nanny? She's speaking <laughs> Japanese. <laughs> it's just another way of saying party. I know it sounds strange. What the fuck? The pillow's got to do with a hoot nanny. People need something to lift their spirits right about now. This could be her last chance. Mm. I want to make some tea for everyone. Could I borrow your little heater thing? What can I do? We need to pretty up the old music room. Could you make us something colorful? They're not being that ass. Okay, I'll be an artist. I'm gonna make the deck, uh, the deck of decoration right a Spit decoration it out. for the party okay i'll get the heater <clears throat> the heater so they want to use my little heater weeder all right place your collectibles before leaving first of all pick that up but what was that I'm done, Clem. come see look okay, like she be cooked right there hot can and hot dog water soup in there shut up, shut up, <laughs> <or> shut <laughs> up, i'm sorry uh, hold on. I think I already placed my collectibles, right? Yeah, I already did. We oh, Gucci. Let me see this drawing. Hey, okay. you're getting better at this. Soon you'll be as good an artist as Ten. I don't know. He's really good. Something wrong? AJ? I was just thinking about stuff while I was drawing. All right. There are three kind of lies, Clem. Hmm. Oh, yeah? There are live people lies. We got those. Then there's monsters eyes. They usually look like dirty water. Other times, monsters eyes aren't even wet. And then there are live people eyes right as you kill them. Like you did to Abel. His, his eyes look like you blew a candle out. He was a bad guy. I know I shouldn't feel like this. I hated him too. I think there's something wrong with me. Never get soft. Some things are hard to look at. Difficult. My boy ain't AJ people. and he ain't gonna be no bitch. You can't let any of that make you soft. Stand on your business. Okay. I wanna be hard. Like you, Clem. I will be one day. I'm gonna let it slide. I'm getting real smart. <laughs> Is that right? Yes, because I'm always thinking all the time. Okay, what are you thinking about right now? You getting bit, turning into a monster. What the fuck? Oh. Why so yeah. deep? The older I get, the more I see it. I don't know why. What happens then? AJ, don't speak it into existence. You're gonna jeek my gross dad. Outside or how careful you are. 
That's not happening. You don't know that. No, I don't. Yo, the day Clementine dies is the day I die. Or till my dies, I'm gonna but die. It won't happen anytime soon. You don't know that either. You're just trying to be brave for me. It does something weird to my stomach. Like I'm gonna get the dookies. AJ, I need to know you remember what we talked about. What you're supposed to do if it happens. Listen to me. If I get bit, you'll... Run away. Shoot me. Wait, why are they... Why are they doing this as an option as if it's gonna happen? Tao Tao? Guys? Y'all know me. If Clementine dies... I'm not ever gonna play any games you recommend. Cause Lee was bad enough. I cried for Lee. I cried for Lee. What do you think I'm gonna do for Clementine? I'm gonna flip this whole world upside down. Shoot me. Shoot. No. No, I'm not gonna do that. AJ, you promised. I don't care. I'm not gonna shoot you. If you get bit, I'd want you to bite me too. What? What? You don't mean that. I don't wanna be alone. Oh, I'm gonna cry. Please don't be mad. I can't live with you not with me, Clem. I know we've talked about it so much, but don't make me. Junior, if you have a gun, you shoot me. If you don't, you use your knife. No knife, a rock to the head as many times as you have to. I said I don't wanna. I don't care what you said. You will do it. I don't care what you say. God damn it, AJ. Ah, <sighs> oh, my heart, man. I you feel like it's coming. Promises, AJ. I know. You're not letting this go, are you? James said. <sighs> Guess not. That we could be around when we're monsters. Like on the inside. If you got bit and then bit me, then maybe we'd still be together. It would just be a different together. We might even be okay. You think so? Let's say James might be right. That monsters have part of the person they were still inside them. The thing is, no one can prove that. And if we can't prove it, we're not going to risk our lives over it. Can I go patrol for a bit? Before the party? Sure, go ahead. Be careful. Yo, bro, please, guys, don't tell me this is how it ends. What's with AJ? He just needs some space. Guys. Can we talk about what happened today with Minnie? Yeah, sure. What's wrong? The thing is, seeing Minnie, I feel like it should have scared me, but it didn't. The person we ran into in the woods that wasn't Minnie. Not really. The way she sounded and acted, the way she talked about Sophie and Lily. <laughs> I'm, I'm confused, I guess. You can save Minnie. You know you can't she is trust one of them. her, right? Think She's about it. She's been with those people for over a year. It sucks, but I don't know what else I expected. Minnie, the real Minnie. She's gone. She's been gone this whole time, and I have to stop mourning her. I won't let her take you or AJ or anyone else I care about. Lewis knows when to keep his head down. Yeah, shit. Well, I, I, I hope so. You know, when I first got here, I hated him. He was so much. You know, he walks into a room and it's like, look at me, watch me perform. It's so stupid. But then I realized under all that, he, he really cares about people. And he doesn't just feel it, he says it. He'll tell you every goddamn day how much you mean to him. Shit, he'll probably sing about it. <laughs> Especially if there's already a famous song with your name in it. 
We've got to get him back. We will. Louis, Omar, Asim, we'll get them all back. Um, I made you this. <sighs> A Clementine? Really? That's cute. It's like a name badge. It'll look good on your jacket. Put it on your hat, Clementine. Aw. Hey, Clem! Damn! Wait, I missed it. Asshole. <laughs> wow. Where did you find a beach ball? It was in some garbage behind one of the dorms. I had to blow it up, and, and that was pretty gross. But look, it works. <laughs> I should get going. Ruby could probably use some help. It's cool, right? Super cool. <laughs> Back. Uh, Bob, it, Bob, it always that. I'm do. I'm sorry. Think fast. Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he did it to me, bro. <laughs> hey, he did it to me. Aw. Damn, bro. I love you, Clem. Ah, my heart! Go back, kiddo. Hey. <sighs> okay, we better get ready to go. Sounds like they need us in the music room. I just okay. love seeing them being happy, man. It's very rare because there's they literally always almost stressed or always going through something. And this bond is like that, man. Yo, it's like that. They locked in. Ain't no switching up for real. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What a weak ass heat can. Looks like things are coming together. Yeah. We still need to figure out lighting, music, and something to write on that band. So everything? If we're gonna die, we should have some fun first. What? Music? But Lewis isn't here. Choose candle See color? That? It's like Lewis in a box. Wouldn't be a party without some kind of mood lighting. I've been going back and forth between colors for ages. Purple. Green's calming, but purple Wait, might more, be nice. That's more so hmm. pink. Well, purple was my dad's favorite color. I read somewhere purple was a color of royalty. Purple. <laughs> really? What? I like purple. Shouldn't you like it too? Violet? Oh, I see what they did. I'll make it happen. Alright. So I'll you take one of those black things that look like plates and you put it on here. Choose music? Hold on. Let me see what type of tunes you got. Gramophone so you can play some records. Drake like drop. Selection, For all the dogs. Do. I don't see this option. Just Where did I tell you? I ain't a classical. You guys have any classical? You bet. Uncultured ass wines, bro. Are we using the banner for some kind of party theme? Mm, not exactly. It's meant to be more motivational. I'd keep it short though. It's not as much. We're room getting the as back. You AJ, want to pick something? Let's have I was AJ thinking pick. something uplifting, like we're gonna get through this. AJ, why don't you come up with something? Really? I have an idea. It'll be a surprise. But. I promise not to swear all over it. Okay, we'll have Ten break out his paintbrush and ride it out. This Yo, Ten will eat a Picasso to great. Oh, and Willie was asking for you. He's up in Marlin's office. He said he had a surprise for the party, but he wanted to show it to you first. Hey, Clem, check it out. I found a bunch of books on ships. All right, Dumbledore. There's some awesome stuff about fires at sea and explosions and stuff. The key is the boiler. Wait, what are you talking about? I have an idea about how to stop those assholes coming back to the school after we've rescued the others. And from hurting anyone else ever again. We're going to blow up the boat. It's the only way to make sure they don't come back. Besides, it feels right, you know? For Mitch. I'm gonna quiet. Bit. I didn't mean to, though. It was a lot. After you get off the boat. 
Trust me, this'll work. We'll be okay. Okay, everybody. Okay. Get ready to I wanted to say that'll kill us all, but. And, um, Clem, I'm sorry for before about how I treated Ten. I didn't mean to get so angry. I know it's not his fault. Aw. That's nice, Willie, but don't tell me. Tell Ten. Hey, facts. What you tell him? What you apologizing to me for? Like, you hurt my feelings. It's down on your business. Really silly. Silly Willie. Stupid boy. Okay, AJ. Okay, AJ, let me see your moves. Alvin Jr., get crazy. Get crazy, Alvin. Rosie coming in there, too. Nah, hold on. Let me find out. Rosie about to do something, too. Hey. There you go, Rosie. Wow. This looks great, Ruby. Couldn't have done it without you. But just wait till you see what else I've got planned. Go ahead and mingle. I'll let you know when it's time. I guess I'll mingle. I see you two are working together. Yeah, Willie asked me to help with his special project. Well, that's good to hear. Is it ready? Good to go, Clem. It'll work. Actually, ah, uh, I was thinking maybe we should name it. Something cool. I mean, I think it deserves a name. All the best bombs have names. Yeah, Let's we absolutely it. have to name it. I thought you'd make fun of me, but hell yeah. Let's name this fucker. Uh, Willie Jr. <sighs> Ruby's Revenge. Let's name it after you, Ruby. Yeah? Hell yeah. Ruby's Revenge. Sounds better than Willie's. Goddamn Willy, right. Uh, Willy Wonka. Fuck what they talking about. We doing Ruby's Revenge. Look at AJ, bro. He getting sturdy. <laughs> I found them. Okay, Clementine. These here are our official Erickson psych evaluations and probationary reports. Okay. I don't get it. Well, these explain why all of us got sent to this school in the first place. And all the bad shit we did that kept them from sending us back home. So, what's the game? I figured if we're all going on this crazy mission together, you might as well know who we really are. So, I'll read some of what the adults thought about us. And you have to guess which one of us fits the bill. I'll make sure it's someone you've actually met. This'll be the first one. While otherwise a remarkable student, blank continues to be plagued by fits of anger, uncontrollable cursing, and repeated physical altercations with the senior faculty. Sound like Japanese to me. I don't know. Marlin? It can't be Marlin. It's Violet. It's gotta be Violet. Nope. Way scarier. That's Ruby's file! <laughs> Holy shit. Really? Guilty as charged. Wait, what? Yeah. How? You should have seen Ruby back in the early days. She was like, uh... You ever seen those Tasmanian Devil cartoons when you were a kid? Hmm. <laughs> that was our Ruby. You used to have a mean streak a mile long. <laughs> Don't worry. That was a long well, time. How was I supposed to know that? I mean, I can totally see it. The first time I met Ruby, she was all, That little motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I said I was sorry. You guys want to know why I got sent here? Willie, please, no. Monic masturbation. What the fuck? Trust me. Nobody wanted to know that. That's why I don't like you, Dimbo Door. Oh my god. Look, bro. Now you got my man's AJ. AJ. Now he about to go. AJ about to go do what you was doing with Willie. Willie? Ah, uh, don't you dare. Ten! I'm about to put ten heads in your head! Uh, anyway. Maybe we should change up the music? I like all kinds of different music, I think. There's a lot of them. We're not doing How no country many? jazz. No, it's alright. People seem to like this. 
Good enough for me. Let's just move on then. I didn't realize how many of us we lost. Remember that Justin guy? And Theresa and Jasper, that one girl with colored braces, and Joey, Maddie, Lamar. Damn, how many of y'all um, got packed up? Yeah. Yeah, I used to make fun of her braces. Yeah. Why did I do that? Alex, Dewey, Trey. Damn, that that Stephen. is long as hell. Holy crap! How many of us died? I don't know. Thirty-four. It's about to, it's about to be 34. We not having nobody else die. <laughs> Yo. Whose is it? Lewis. Should we read it? I could tell you why I was sent here instead. You know, as a consolation prize or whatever. You might hate me after, but since we're all being so open and all. Uh, who are you before? It doesn't matter. I was hoping you'd tell me. I spent a lot of time at my grandma's house growing up. What with my dad being a drunk and my mom working three jobs. But after my grandpa died, grandma just kind of shut down. Spent all day and night rocking in her little chair in the den. I'd sit there at her feet as we both watched TV. Mostly cartoons, since she never seemed to care. Sometimes I could hear her crying, but I didn't look back. I'd just feel really weird and turn up the volume, you know? Why are you doing your granny like Anyway, that? one day she left the den and came back with another chair and a twenty-two rifle. All right. Set the rifle butt on the top of the chair, holding the barrel back to her chest. So, you know, she had trouble reaching the trigger this way, but... She must have known it would happen because she took out this really tacky wooden back scratcher. The real long kind with the one end shaped like a hand. Why is she saying and, all this? Uh, use that to push the trigger in. And you watched it. So yeah. Bang. Right. She had evil. Body hole. folded up and just kept rocking. I know they say not to judge you by your mom past. came to get me five hours later. I hadn't moved. She asked why I didn't call the police or an ambulance or anything. Why you even trying to stop her? I just shrugged and told her it wasn't like Grandma was going anywhere. And besides, I just wanted to finish my cartoons. Even Rosie sleeping through your bullshit. She shipped me off to Erickson the next day. I was 11. Because you sick. Who does that? I'm saying quiet. Fuck you. How do I know you ain't going to do me like you did your granny? No, I don't know why I did it either. But I can't change what happened. We weren't good people, Clementine. But it still doesn't mean that we should have been left here to die by the people that were supposed to take care of us. Oh, yeah, Sorry. This is supposed to be fun. I'm... I'm just not the game type, like Lewis was, I guess. You mean is. We'll see him soon. Ten's right. Hey, I've got an idea. Do you guys remember when Minnie would sing us Don't Be Afraid when all of us used to get scared? Too bad I can't play it. Lou would have known how. Huh? He'd like that one. You could just sing it to us, like she used to. Your voice is really pretty. Okay. Okay, yeah. All right, I, uh... I can do that. Let's hear this, y'all. Let's hear this. Dog's like, what the fuck? Never mind the blood red moon. The night will be over soon. The it's not bad. night will be over soon. Brush 
wash away the sorrow, brush away the tears, sing away your heavy heart. The night will be over soon. The night will be over soon. That's beautiful. For every night goes quiet, and every moon grows blue. Beyond the dark comes something new. The sun will be rising soon. The sun will be rising soon. The sun will be rising soon. Clap it up. Damn, y'all, clap it up! Oh. Man, you stupid bitch! Damn, here we go. Oh, we about to roll up on him. Flashback. Oh my gosh, she's so young. Hey, sweet pea. We? Why the train? You always pick the train. I'm not sure. Maybe because this is where it all started. Where you taught me to shoot and to cut my hair. To be ready for what was coming. You were a quick stunny. So, what's on your mind this time? I miss him, bro. I'm worried, Lee. I've got a lot of people depending on me, and I don't know if what I'm doing is right. Oh, I know that feeling. You know, I was uh, making it all up as I went along, right? <sighs> Couldn't let on, of course. I never noticed. It just felt like you always knew the right thing to do. Eh? Yeah. Well, I got lucky. Luck counts for a lot. I'm gonna need some now. You wanna tell me about what you're up against? I'm with a new group now. And I've been in so many. And they always fall apart. But I really like this one. It's different. It almost feels like home. That's a good thing. It's hard being alone out there. But we're in trouble. Some bad people captured my friends, and getting them back might get the rest of us killed. Oh, man. I'm not worried. Why well, know you're what? not. Whatever trouble you're in, you get out of it. You get your friends out of it. You don't know that. I know you're a survivor. The Clementine I know is gonna fix it. I really believe that. But what if I can't? I'm so scared for my friends, Lee. Scared that I'll... I'll let them down. It's normal to be scared. Hell, it'd be strange if you weren't. But you can't let it get to you. Imagine what Lewis is gonna say when he sees your face. Those boys are gonna have hope again knowing that you came to rescue him. <sighs> oh, sweet pea, you know you always get like this before something big. Remember how scared you were before you charged into that mess at McCarroll Branch? You survived that, didn't you? That was different. 
I was alone. I know. It's harder when you have something to lose. But having people you care about, that's a good thing. They're fighting beside you. Because of you. Come see me again, when you've gotten them out, okay? Out and safe. Sound good? And hopefully we can talk about happier things. If you know of any. Lee, I miss you so much. I wish you were really here. <sighs> I miss you too, Clementine. But we'll have to make do with pretending. Thank you, Lee. Talking to you always makes me feel a little bit better. I meant to ask. How's the boy? He's good, Lee. You'd like him. I bet. You teach him to shoot yet? <laughs> You have no idea. He a demon. I guess the world got pretty hard since I left it. A kid growing up in it, he'd be hard too. You're in my shoes now, raising a kid. Think you got a handle on it? Uh, it can't be easy. Wanting to give him a childhood, but knowing what it takes to survive now. AJ's amazingly. I've taught him to be strong and brave and capable. You'd be so proud. You mean more than I already am? Man, I needed that. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie to you. Oh, I just know. I know she heard it right now. short um you don't know how hard it is to find scissors these days <laughs> <laughs> time to go clementine you've got people that need you i need that i love you lee <gasps> goodbye lee I miss you my boy I flashback. Ooh. Clint, wake up. It's time to go. We got a long walk. You are relying on, on me. I can't. I can't disappoint. <gasps> are we starting like this? What happened to the walk? <laughs> yep, we already here. Uh, I guess we're really doing this. Only the team blending in with the walkers need to cover themselves. Now we just need your walker friend to hear. Good lord. Uh, hello. Why he just built like that, bro? Guys, this is James. He's my friend. Our friend? He's, uh, so cool. How do you get the skin like that? Uh, oh, I, um, Clementine? Can I try it on? That's not a good... Well, come on, give him some space. But I just want to... Not right now. Yeah. Yeah, right. Sorry. I didn't mean to be weird or anything. It's okay. Oh, and sorry I tried to shoot you that one time. Your mask looks so real. I, uh, uh, hey. Hey there, James. 
Sorry about Willie. Okay. Um, Clementine, could I speak to you alone for a moment? Good idea. Hold tight. Hey, Tank, can you come talk Hold for tight. a sec? There's something I have to tell you. The walkers. They'll be here in a little while. You can join them as they pass through the trees. The noise from the boat will draw them toward the water. Then we can get on board and save our friends. Your friends are... different. Open-minded. Accepting. No, they don't want to join like you, you, little zombie cult. That's not usually how my first impressions go. Sorry, I feel like I'm rambling. It's just... being welcomed. It's strange. You know, they could be your friends, too. I know you didn't want to come into the school before, but now that you've met them... I haven't lived with people in a long time. But... it does sound nice. Let me think about it. I wanted to show you something. This is... was my boyfriend, Charlie. What? We joined the Whisperers together. But... it changed him. In a way that couldn't be undone. Y'all look like siblings. I don't want to lie to What do you mean? The Whisperers were my family. From a young age. In that time, I witnessed a lot of death. Okay. Suffering. Eventually, I became the cause of it. Weakness was considered a poison. And I believed in that. Fiercely. So much so. That when another boy expressed sympathy for our enemy before an attack. Wait, what just happened? I slit his throat. Why? And talk to him. Didn't consider who he was, what he felt. <laughs> Honestly, I don't even remember his name. All I knew was He's someone about to help like us. him I ain't gonna say us down. That was enough of a reason for me. I had no doubt in my mind that I was right. After he died, I kept hearing his words in my head. Those people are like us, just on a different path. I stopped killing after that. I changed. No one else did. When AJ told me he killed Sickness, someone, I'm telling you, mental it disease. reminded me of them. Of myself. When he said it was the right thing to do. Taking life like that from a young age, it breaks something inside you. How do I know he... It broke something in Charlie. I just... I'm afraid if AJ kills again, he won't be able to go back. He won't be the same boy he was. I've seen it happen too many times. Being ruthless is what's kept him alive. That's all that matters. And if history remains true, it'll be what gets him killed. Not sure. Don't speak on my mans like that. They're close. Soon there will be enough of them to provide us cover. I'll lead you through the herd until you reach the boat. That's as far as I go. After that, it's up to you. Thank you. Even the way he puts a mask on is creepy. Take care of AJ. Got to my boy. Okay, he's ready to go. The walkers are getting close. Ruby, you're in charge of the horses. Willie, Ted, take care of the supplies. I've got the bomb. Find the boiler. There'll be a door on the bottom with ash and stuff. Put it in there. Go time. We on go time. Come on. We on go time. Everybody. See you all on the other side. See you. Here we go. I'll cut it open. What's up, gangster? Violet told me about Minnie. That Sophie died, and Minnie is one of them now. Just 
if you see her out there, tell her. Tell her I forgive her. Gotcha, my boy. I tell her myself, but I just want her to be okay. Yeah, gotcha. sure. If we see her, I'll let her know. A deal is a Thanks. deal, my boy. A deal is a deal, my boy. What's she doing, bro? Getting you feels every day, 24-7, Violet. Hey, it's time. We gotta move. Clem? Oh, my fucking gosh. What happens if someone else gets caught while we're in there? Man. We go out shooting. What if it's you? I couldn't save Minnie or Lou or a sin. Omar. You saved me from these people. In a way, you've saved most of us. And if something happened to you, and it was my fault, I can't lose you too. I won't. Come here, bring it in, big teddy bear. You better not disappear on me, okay? I got okay. Oh, Clementine, never go down. Big stuff, but. All we do is step, we step, 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 step. Yeah, I think so. I get out your feelings. Okay, let's bring our friends back home. Let's do this. All of them. Yes, All sir. That's the energy I need. We bring That's everybody right. back home. We... All right, y'all. Get your so, blood and guts I on. Know this is going to sound gross, but... Covering your smell. <laughs> Smart. Mmm, guts. I love guts. Uh, I want to eat it all. Alright, damn. Oh. Give me back. I got you. I'm about to smear it on the back of your head. Thanks. Why is the texture so detailed, though? We gonna do it? We're doing it. Oh! Okay. Okay. Wait, we gotta. We look a little too sus, though. Okay. Follow my lead. Alright. Here we go. Alright. Get to the pier. Boom. Get behind walkers. Come on, y'all. Stay behind the walkers. Use them as shields. Make sure you don't get caught up. Wait, grab it back. There you go. Alright. Alright, wait for the light. Got it. Got it. Hold on. Good. Oh God. Oh God. Oh. We're good. We're just like that. Dang, there ain't no more walkers left. Damn it, the horses! Hey, get their fire under control. Get rid of these fucking walkers! Alright, we got on the pier. Come on, Willie. Damn! Oh, poor okay, Willie. Now's our chance. We can't risk leaving cover. We'll have to crawl along the side of the dock. Okay. Damn. That could have been me, y'all. Could have been, should have been, would have been. We good then. The guts are washing off. Oh god, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. You're right, get up. I know she hear this. Follow me. This way. Which way? Oh my god. 
Walker, swim. Go, 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 go. The guts are off. The guts are off. Yeah, we're done for. Damn! I got it. I got it. I got it. Get your mother. Get your. Get your. Get your filthy ass hands off. Hurry up, Violet. Grab my hand. Hurry up. Put another one. Grab me in. Fuck. Are you okay? I'm fine. Stay close. Wow. There you go. And just like that. Good. Come on. Come on, let's hurry. Ready, AJ? Walkers! Man, screw them walkers, bro. We not fight, bro. Got it. On the boat now. I was up. We're getting close. After we find the boiler and place the bomb, we'll get our friends out. Minnie said there were eight raiders, but we didn't see that many outside. Look out for guards and stay quiet, okay? Right behind you. Good. I'll scout ahead and signal when it's clear. Got it? Find the boiler. Oh god. Alright. Blooded. Cold blooded. Hey, Glenn. This has got to be the boiler, right? Yeah, it looks like it. That's where we need to plant the bomb. There's too much stuff in the way. Maybe there's another way in. Take him out, yeah. I got it. I got it. Hello, stupid. I'm here for my friends. I'm here for my friends, buddy. Damn. Shoot him in the head. No mercy. No mercy. We ended like swimwear. Y'all saw that? Come on. Throw that hoe in there. Capiche. Here we go. Time to live up to your name, Ruby's Revenge. Bury this thing in the bottom of the river. Once they start up this boat, we won't have much time before it explodes. How long? I'm not sure. An hour, 30 minutes. Let's hurry up then. Find your friends. So what we did right there. 
basically we about to blow this thing out the bike at all. Minerva, See? focus. Yes, ma'am. I, I have a little brother, short, scarred face. See, he's not out there, is he? Look, we've discussed this. Your family is Delta now. There ain't no room for anyone else. Yes, ma'am. I'm Shit. sorry, she gotta go. Of course she had to be the cell guard. We can't sneak past her. Sorry. Get out. Not without our people. I swear to God, if you got Ten caught up in this, just, just tell me that he's safe. Give me that. Ten says he forgives you. He told me to tell you. He forgives you. <sighs> Shit. I'll help you get everyone out. Then you take my brother and run. Get him back to where it's safe. Deal. I could do that. Come on, we have to hurry. Clementine? Holy fuck! Oh my god, are you okay? He doesn't look hurt. I... Uh, yeah, I'm alright. We're alright. Take care of Louis first. He's... he's in rough shape. I'll unlock the other cell. We don't have a lot of time before Doreen comes back. Violet, help me with these guys. Got it. Lewis? 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 Damn! What the fuck are you doing? Please. Don't no. fucking point at us! Don't have to. No! 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 Huh? Oh. Lewis. What is the point in this? This is so fucking stupid. I'll make these bastards pay for this. I promise you, Lewis. <laughs> It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You'll be home soon. We're not staying here that long. No, sir. It's gotta be something else. Can't even talk to the man, he ain't got no time. Clem, are you all right? I'm fine. Where's AJ? Over here! What the guy you do? At least we're not moving yet. We've still got time to figure this out.
I might be able to chip away at this if I had a tool or... Damn it, they must have taken away my knife. AJ! Do you still have your knife? Yeah, they didn't find it. Only the big one. Good. I need you to slide it over to me. Don't mess this up, AJ. His ear or something? Why is she looking at him like that? That bitch betrayed us, bro. Hey! <gasps> Whatever you doing, don't. I promise you, it ain't worth it. Step back. She awake? Yes, ma'am. Good. I'll take it from here. Really, Lily? <laughs> Shut your ass. You a bitch! Where's Abel? He's dead. We killed him. We put a knife in his head. Fuck. You little monster. Damn it! We showed him mercy. He was terrified of turning, so we stopped him from having to. We gave him what he wanted. <laughs> I'm sure you did. Back up. There's no way. Minerva. Open the door. Yes, ma'am. They're about to kill me. Guys, if this is how it all ends right here. Normally, the trouble you caused, I'd shoot you and toss you overboard. But I'm genuinely impressed. First you organize these idiot kids into a fighting force and kill two of my most experienced soldiers. Then you sneak onto my boat under the cover of a herd. I bring a prize like you back to the Delta. It might make this whole clusterfuck of a mission worth it. Someone like you, so young with so much potential, you're far too valuable to kill. Look. If I'm the one you want, let the others go. This isn't a negotiation. This is me telling you how things are going to be. You know, my father, Larry, was a military man. And when I was a kid, he had all kinds of rules. The thing that bugged him most was waste. If I ever left a light on after leaving a room, <laughs> he'd flip. That's me. No matter how many times he ranted about the cost of electricity, I could never remember to hit that switch. So? So one day, he let our power get cut. He liked illustrations to show that actions have consequences. No more TV, no more hair dryer, no more ice cream sandwiches. Just a miserable family sitting in the dark. That seems like a pretty stupid way to make a point. It was extreme, but I never left the lights on again. My father had his faults, but he showed me the effectiveness of teaching by example. Oh, is that what this is? A lesson? I want to tell you a story. Let's call it... The Parable of the Twins. Two girls were taken from their home and brought to a new place to live. They had to leave their friends and family behind and that was hard at first. They shed a lot of tears. But the new place was a good place. 
The people there grew corn and raised pigs, and the twins ate well for the first time in years. They had hot showers, clean clothes, beds. They were given guns and trained to use them. The people there were kind to these girls. All that was asked in return was that they help defend the group. You see, this place had a lot of enemies, killers and thieves who wanted what they had. They needed help fighting, or they'd lose everything they built. Their crops, their power, even their lives. Play with our game. Putting guns in their hands and forcing them to fight? How generous. They were just doing what they needed to survive. One of the girls saw that this was a place worth fighting for, and her tears dried. But the other twin, she could never forget her old home. She rejected every gift, every opportunity, stirred up trouble every chance she got. She convinced her sister to help her steal a raft and leave on the river. Of course, they didn't get far. What happened then, Minerva? I killed her. What the Jesus fuck? Jesus Christ. What? Minnie. No, tell me it's not true. Your own sister? Why would you do that? She was twisting my head with her lies. And? I made a mistake. I needed to show my loyalty to the place I call home. Like it or not, you're one of my people now, Clem. The question huh? is, which twin are you going to be? The loyal one or the dead one? What have you done to her head, you fucking psychotic bitch? You're evil! You are fucking evil! All right, Lily, you made your point. I'll do what you want. What? No! You can't become a soldier in their army. Hold on, Violet, I'm gonna figure Just it out. Don't hurt anyone else. Good. I'm surprised to hear you bend so easily. But as I said before, this isn't a negotiation. Pull the mouthy one out of the cell. Oh my god. They clearly didn't get the moral of the story. We'll have to help them understand. Stop! Don't hurt Violet, or I'll hurt you. Hey, yo. You better cool it, or you gonna get yourself hurt. Fuck no! Get off of me! Uh, Easy! Uh, Stay still! Shit! Fuck you! No! Don't do this. Don't make this hurt more than it has to. Damn, bro! <laughs> Fuck that! He a demon! Come on. No, 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 I can't. I can't. I can't. What if they kill AJ? Just breathe. Yeah. Get him! AJ! Damn! Son of a bitch! Enough. He bit me. I said that's enough. You deserve to die. We'll kill you. You think you can kill me? I know I can. We'll throw you in the river. I will put a knife right to the side of your head. Big talk for a little guy. <sighs> I know I can do it. I killed Marlin, and I was justified. Dang. That's my boy! So you killed Marlin. Huh. I bet you'd make a great soldier. Leave him alone. This is between us. Clem seems to care a lot about you. Come on, let's go have a chat. Just us. Don't you fucking touch him! 
Clem! No, no, please! Clem inside! AJ! I'm Keep an eye I'm on her, Nova. Lily, don't! Get this thing moving. I want to be far away from here. Fast. I'll start up the boiler. Don't. Don't you dare look at me like that! Shut up, bitch! I'll kill you! This is the only way we survive. Who are you? Fuck survival! Look at what you're doing! Minnie, please. I just want to talk to you for a second. I'm sorry we never searched for you. We're Sophie. I'm sorry we trusted that fucker Marlin. If I ever thought it was a chance. I know. I know. Okay? But Sophie's dead. You all so need are to you. understand. This is the only way. Lay down, stay in line, or you die. The people you love die. I'm about to kill her. If you just do what they say, you can live. All of Shut you. Shut up, bitch. You're done for. Kill her, bro. Behind you. I got it. I got You're it. I got it. Fucking problem here. Okay, my kneecap. Wait, what? I won't let you get them all killed. No. What? Oh, this bitch is dying. Shoot her. Shoot her. I can't let her leave. Shit. Nene on her grave. Nene. Who cares about that raggedy asshole? Come on, gang. We out. Come on. We have to go. I can't. I can't leave her. Bro, nobody cares go, about this raggedy up. hoe. Clem, come on. We have to get the hell out of here. I don't care about Violet. Go. I need to find AJ. Better see you on land. You will. Kick her head, bro. I would have kick, stomp the hell out of her head. Violet, you can join her. Really? Lily, it's on. Shit, they started the boiler. We'll focus that energy. Sharpen it. I've known Clementine since before this all started. She'll come around. You'll come around too, once you see what we have. Found one more sneaking Plenty over the food, docks. Comfortable beds for you and Clem. Ten! Fuck. Damn. Tennessee, did you get lost? Ma'am! He wasn't alone. I got something else to show you. This way. Found this in the herd. <clears throat> Bro, James, how you, how you go down like that, James? James, how you go down like that? No wonder there were so many walkers. <laughs> Must have thought you were clever leading those walkers here. Or was that Clementine's idea? <sighs> Nothing to say? You don't fucking scare me. <laughs> Is that so? Force your ways onto others. Because you're afraid. Because Don't worry, James. Weak. I'm gonna take care of her. I give my people a cause to fight for. The thing about people like him, AJ, is that they're too broken to fit into a community. They won't fight for anyone but themselves. <laughs> Kill it. No! Wait, what? Easy there, Ten. Don't hurt him. Just stop hurting people. Please. Shoot her. Shoot her. Why don't we all just take a breath? Shoot her, Ten. Shoot her. Put, put down the gun. Let them go. Shoot her. All of us. Or, or else. No. Fine. Go ahead then. Do it. Save your friend. Shoot her, bro. Shoot her. That's what you came here to do, is Do it. it! Do it! <laughs> oh, 
I see. You came here to cry. Tim. Looks like you're not a soldier either. Please, don't! No! Ah! On it! On it, AJ! Yup! Stupid bitch! I've been waiting to get my hands on you! I've been waiting! Get that shit! Get it! Really? AJ? Watch out, kneecap, bitch! Watch out! Watch out! Why oh, be waiting? Okay. There you go. Stupid hoe. Stupid hoe. Come on. 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 Oh, you picked the wall. What's it? I can't. It's not working. AJ? AJ? Get her! It's all good. There you go. I know that ACR heard it right now. Dang it! Get the gun. AJ. Don't you fucking dare, AJ. Do it. Do it. Just give me the gun. You can't let her hurt anyone else. AJ, AJ. shoot her. That's my boy! Get the fuck out of here! That ain't gonna crack that! That's who I raised! Keep playing with me. Lily, couldn't find the other. What did you do? You fucking dead. Shit, the bomb. AJ! That's how it ends? For real? I don't care. That's a that's a win is a win. I don't give a damn. I won. I did that. Fuck that bitch, Lily. She's fucking gone. Bro, that bitch, Lily, pissed me off. She done pissed me off so bad, I don't even want to upload this. Damn. I'm going to see you tomorrow, bro. And now, folks, it's time to say goodnight. We sincerely appreciate your patronage and hope we've succeeded in bringing you an enjoyable evening of entertainment. Please drive home carefully and come back again soon. Good night.